Games Workshop 1, we focus on the player experience, and I think that's something to take away. It's different from feature side is that we work differently. Um, some of the challenges are that we, we talk about player control, player response, and that ultimately changes the you know the way you're, you work with animation. Timing is different. Um, you have less time to maybe show anticipation. So what does that mean? Um, sometimes it takes away from the weight of a character. Uh, so we have to, there's a set of challenges that we have to work with. It's because of player control. We want our player to feel alive and responsive. So for instance, when you do a jump, um, you don't just animate a full-on jump cycle because a jump could, you know, you could go from a jump into a double jump or attack in midair. So we often have to branch, meaning we have to like interrupt the animation and go into another animation. So we teach that at iAnime. We teach about how we branch and why do we do it and how do we do it. I teach Game Workshop 1 at iAnime and we're focusing on the fundamentals of games and focusing on the body mechanics specifically and it's getting the students up and ready so that they're, you know, they could be more suited and ramped up at a game development cycle when they do start a new game studio. That's one great thing about iAnime is that the classes are being shared. Um, it's you can watch other instructors classes and that's great I tell the students too it's you know I'm teaching you one way but do watch the other recordings because they teach a different way and it only complements your learning 